right on cue the bells of the bells of the local church down there oh man that was some climb climbed up cycled up and walked up to uh, Schloss Vikon and um, that's Marienburg and Schloss Vikon is kind of in behind it you can't really see it there's sort of a red tiled roof in back behind that's the old castle Schloss Vikon um, where the Ukrainian refugees are, are housed at the moment. There's about 80 or 90 of them, something like that. Uh, so down there you have Britnau and further down you have Zofingen and Oftringen and Arburg would be kind of behind the hills there. Um, you have a big, uh, oh god, you have a few Mulans there, or Milans, which are kites. So you see a few kites there, it's pretty cool. The Ura Mountains there in the background on the horizon. Um, you have the main road going up to the town of uh, Ryden, and Ryden is um, where you can see that church there. That's uh, the town of Ryden, where they also have asylum seekers based there as well, but they're more kind of Middle Eastern, Afghani, Iraqi, Syrian, um, that neck of the woods, that, that area generally. Um, yeah something I could talk about again but for now just to show you the the um, yeah the scenery it's absolutely absolutely jaw-dropping really beautiful vista from here on one of the hottest days of the year so far that uh, tower you see in the middle there that is from from the train station to Vicon Vicon uh, Britain now Vicon uh, train station so yeah spectacular views from up here and uh very very tiring getting up here jesus it was it was some slog getting up here between cycling and walking i won't be doing it again in a hurry no matter with the these kind of views so there we go that's all for now folks